The mayor of Hoboken, who is a practicing Sikh, is speaking out after he says he was the target of threatening letters in the mail. The first called on him to resign, and they only got worse from there. Well, tonight he is pushing back, and CBS 2's Naveen Dhaliwal has the exclusive. It's Mayor Robbie Bala's dream accomplishment to run the city of Hoboken. I'm very proud to lead this city as an American of Sikh background. For a man who always wears his religious head covering with pride, he now says he's been the target of threatening messages. Our family began receiving a series of letters in the mail. The first more than a year ago, asking him to resign. Then a second letter threatening his life. Then came the third. The uh, third threat, which um, was the most jolting, uh, came soon thereafter and said that this is your last warning. Uh, if we don't, if you don't resign immediately, uh, we'll kill you, we'll kill your wife, we'll kill your children. Here's one of them saying, "It's time to kill you." The rest of it too disturbing to show. There was a lot of uh, just angst, anger, a lot of hate uh, combined with uh, actual threats upon my life and the life of my children and my, my wife. It was enough for law enforcement agencies to provide the mayor with 24 hour security, including for his two children at school. My biggest concern was for my kids. Um, you know, I signed up to be mayor, but my kids did not sign up uh, for this type of behavior. Mayor Bala says while he was getting these threatening letters, his neighbors, his brother, and even his colleagues were receiving threatening packages with sexually explicit materials inside. He says the person responsible for those was caught in charge, but the person behind the letters is still out there. For Mayor Bala, who is well aware of the backlash sick Americans endured after 9-11. How do you feel that 22 years later, that this is what you're experiencing as a political figure? As a sick American, I'm a proud American, and I want people to be treated equally. His mission for inclusion and education is stronger than ever in this city. There still is a strain of extremism in America, and it's just unfortunate to see that, um, you know, that small strain is somewhere in Hoboken as well. Um, and I think that's what needs to be called out, um, and that's what uh, people need to know about so that, um, you know, we can eventually put an end to it through education and through love. In Hoboken, Naveen Dhaliwal, CBS 2 News.